Uh, this is the book of Luke, chapter 21, verse 9. It reads the Holy Scripture. But when ye should hear of wars and commotions, be not terrified for these things. Must first come to pass, but the end is not by and by. This is the book of Luke, chapter 21, verse 10. And it reads the Holy Scriptures. Then say he unto them, Nation shall rise against nation, and kingdom against kingdom. Shalom, first and foremost, I give you all praises and glory and honor too. to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Fakar Kanash. Shalom to the elders of Great Millstone for Christian Word, truth and sincerity. And Shalom to the Akim, scattered the four corners of the world, Christian Word, truth and sincerity as well too. I say Shalom to the Akim out there. And this is a news article from RT.com, June 19, 2023. And it reads. Russia has launched an active offense operation in Kevin. Moscow is seeking to seize the initiative from Kevin by launching several attacks in the Donbass in the Karolkov region. Ukraine officials have claimed. It says Russian forces have struck Ukraine troops on several fronts in an apparent attempt to assume the initiative. Ukraine Defense Minister Anna Meliar claimed on Monday the development comes at the much tout Ukraine counteroffense of recent weeks has failed to bring about any major changes on the front lines. Moscow has mobilized additional uh, forces in mounting an active offense operation in the Kransky uh, Kransky if I pronounce that right uh, Lyman in the uh, Kupriansky areas and Meliar said in a telegram post adding that the Russian troops were trying to seize the initiative from us. Cafe forts in these areas has been subject to a tense, a tense shelling, she added. According to the Meliar, Russian troops were still seeking to reach the administration borders of the Donskin and the Longskin People's Republic. Princely Lyman is a Ukraine held town in the northern part of Donsky People's Republic. Uh, Kupiansky is a town in the eastern part of Kurilov region, located not far from the Longestein Public Republic border. It's also a major railway junction. It says the Russian command has supposedly constructed significant forces in the area, including elite airborne assault units and deputy minister says the Ukrainian troops has allegedly been able to so far throttle attempts at advancing, she added. The Russian Defense Ministry did not comment on these uh, statements. Neither did it announce any offense actions on the Kurpin front. Russian front, I mean Russian forces stopped to Ukraine reconnaissance and sabotage groups. The minister says that a daily briefing on Monday, adding that Ukraine has lost up to 45 soldiers here as well as three infantry fighting vehicles the iv i mean the ifvs a piece of self-propelled artillery applied by pope so i'm gonna read, read the rest of that bring out the matthews 24 and 7. And this is the book of Matthew, chapter 24, verse 7, and it reads the Holy Scriptures. For nation shall rise against nation, and kingdom against kingdom, and there shall be famines and pestilence and earthquakes in diverse places. Matthew 24, 6, go up a verse. Matthew 24 and 6 and it reads through the Holy Scriptures. And ye shall hear of wars and rumors of war. See that ye be not troubled for all these things must come to pass, but then it's not yet.
And so with that, hopefully this lesson was edifying of this recent news article from uh, RT.com. Alternative world news around the world from RT.com as of June, June 19, 2023, as it says again. Uh, Russia has launched an active uh, offense operation. So with that, hopefully this lesson was out of fun. This is uh, a sit-down lesson. So with that, I would like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashem, Akadash. Shalom to the elders of Great Millstone for Christian world, truthfully and sincerely. And shalom to the Akim, scattered the four corners of the globe, Christian world, truthfully and sincerely as well, too. And until next time, I will say shalom.